Hello everyone, I'm Miss Adams, one of the North Georgia Tech Cosmetology Instructors. Hope everyone's staying safe with COVID-19. We thought it would be helpful to reach out to our community and give you some helpful tips to survive this time at home. We know that it's spring and we would like to get out, even though it's in our backyard and enjoy the weather, and we want our toes to look nice and pretty even though we're out just at home. So something that would be helpful is to get you um, a tub of some sort to soak your feet in with some warm water and some soap. I have a petty soap here, but any kind of body wash or hand soap would help. Just want to soak your feet for five to 10 minutes to soften up your skin and your toenails. It'll help cut your toenails a lot easier. Once you do that, you want to take them out and cut your toenails with, of course, the big toenail clippers that you see here. Cut straight across, not cutting your skin, and then you want to file and you want to file straight across and keep it square. Um, you can cut um, file corner to center, corner to center, or just straight across. Make sure you don't get ingrow toenails by keeping your toenails square. Then you might want to take a petty scrub of some sort, and I have one here. If you don't have anything like this, you can make something with brown sugar and olive oil. And once you put that on, if you have a little petty foot file here, you can use that to help scrub with the scrub to get the dead dry skin off. Um, once you do that, of course, rinse them back off and dry it off. And of course, you want to finish with some polish to help them look pretty as you're out in the yard. Uh, you want to use some toe separators because that helps with polishing so your toes are not so close together. If you don't have that, putting some cotton in between your toes will help keep them separated. Um, after you do that, you want to polish and you want to use a base coat. If you don't have one that says base coat, a clearer coat of some sort will help also. Um, the base coat is to help with staining, but it also helps the polish stay longer. Then you want to take your color and do two coats of any color that you like. And then, of course, you want to finish with a top coat. Well, I hope this has been helpful for you, and I hope everyone is staying safe with a smile on your face.